is under attack. Whoa. Commander, this is One Matt minute. Horner. Just hold on. Cavalry's on the way. Freaking minutes. Take your time, Matt. No rush. Hey man, no rush. No rush. Don't worry, got all the time in the world. Oh, we could use some help. Hey, go help. You better send some body bags. You filled their places. Oh god, Doodlesk! Can I do that? Is any focus? Not bad. Why do you help here? My frames are freaking 10 per second. 10 per second. Can you tell? Can you even tell? I don't know if you can tell. This better be good. This guy's here. Why are there random zerglings spawning in my base? depleted. Base is under attack. I win! I win! As that battle cruiser destroys everything with its AoE magic. Not bad. Oh, Yamato Cannon! Oh, yeah! Oh my god, that Nidus worm just got pwned! He's got WTF laser in the face. Cavalry's arrived. Anyone still alive down there? Good to see you, Matt. Welcome to the party. They still can't break well, we my defenses. Time, they still can't well, break you boys out of there. Not even in the cinematic where they're supposed to break it. That's how sick my defense was. Oh my god, look at the time. 2012. That's a sign. It's a sign that all of this is gonna happen in 2012. Zero are gonna come among us and we have to defend ourselves in bunkers. In a little 10 by 10 area. Alright, rescued all the little rebel squads, killed 820 units, and we lost 47. It's a pretty good ratio, I like it. And I trained 184 units, and I lost one structure. Crap. Okay, whatever. I killed no hatcheries, but how are you supposed to go out there and kill hatcheries anyway? They have spying cars out there, they got mass units. They're freaking zerg. Alright, so I had to redo that, actually, because because I actually um, messed up my recording, so I went back into the Mission Archives and did it. So now we're going to go into cin cinematic that's supposed to precede that, which is this one. HOLY MUTILISK! Damn, Jimmy. You've been holding out on me. Cutting it pretty close there, Matt. Never left you hanging before, sir. Fair enough. Just get us the hell out of here. Oh yeah, that's the subtitles for you. All batteries, concentrate forward firepower. Spin up drives two and six. Is it just me or those turrets are not really All hitting much? All hands for warp jump on my mark. Mark. <laughs> it's like it's like Star Wars light speed. We ain't seen the Zerg in years. Why attack Marsara now? It's not just Marsara. You need to see this. Zerg Swarm launched a full scale attack. Devastation spread throughout all outer rim fronts. Sustained heavy losses. Casualties in the billions. Minutes ago, the Zerg attacked a Dominion military research facility. Oh, that must hurt. Thank God that wasn't Kate Lockwell. Mother of mercy. Video footage confirms the Queen of Blades is in fact leading the storm. Oh, she had a new hairdo. Those corn rolls. But Sarah's back. And that's not good news for Jimmy. We always knew she'd be back. But what's she after? She's come to finish the job. She's come to finish the Booyakasha! job. <laughs> I've watched that cinematic too much. I'm such a nerd. Alright, so that's cinematic, and now we come back to here. Our main screen. Alright, let's ask. One hell of a ship you got here, Jimmy. How'd you get a hold of a floating palace like this? The Hyperion was Mink's flagship back in the day. 
Me and Matt decided to borrow her when we parted company with him. So old baby seen us through Sounds some like tight spots. Sounds like nerd in the background doing. Speaking of tight spots, Tychus, why are you still wearing that suit on my, my bridge? bridge? Yeah, would you bust the zipper or something? Okay, so I might have had a little Itty help bitty when I broke out of prison. Let's just say it came at a price. I get to stay locked up in this suit till I pay off all my debts. And who's collecting those debts? Who sprung you? The Mobius boys, of course. I didn't just run into them in a museum, you know. They want them artifacts something, something fierce. fierce. Your debts better not bite us in the ass, Tychus. Covering for your shenanigans ain't part of the deal. Are you playing on a Game Boy? Uh, okay, what does this guy have to say? Yeah, uh, sir. Any chance you'll get the lab up and running soon? Shut That'd up, nerd. Good. Just how bad is it, Matt? Zerg are attacking all over the sector, sir. Manx pulled the fleet back to protect the Dominion core worlds, leaving the fringe worlds to fend for themselves. Typical it's a Manx. nightmare. There's no way we can stop an alien invasion with one capital ship and a handful of volunteers. Best we just stay clear, partner. We can earn ourselves a fortune working for Mobius while this whole thing blows over. You don't get it, convict. Oh, shit. This isn't gonna just blow over. The Zerg won't stop until we're all dead. Dead, I don't say. Worry, Matt. We ain't sitting this one out. But we're not exactly in tip-top shape, either. We'll earn some cash and build up our forces so we can make a difference when it counts. Ah, see, Jimmy? He compensated. He's not sitting out, but he's gonna make money. And... Yeah, he's not gonna sit out. Just what Matt wanted. Kind of mess that up. All right, let's go to the armory because it's blinking and it wants us to go there. Hey, Swan. Hey, everybody! Our glorious leader has returned. <laughs> hey, man, what's up, cowboy? What do you got for me, Swan? Uh, the usual, building up our standing forces, bringing my troops and hardware up to speed. Good job, Swan. Yep, you can add upgrades for the tech right here on the console, but building an army on the run ain't cheap. You brought back credits this time, right? Look, I know money's been tight, but that artifact we just picked up from Marsar is gonna solve everything. Everything! Yeah, I've heard that before, brother. It's different this time. Yeah, I heard that one too. <laughs> Smarty, smart pants. Alright, let's see what upgrades he has. Check base. Projectile accelerator. Increases the bunker range by one. Or the Neo Steel Bunker. Increases the number of slots in the bunker from 4 to 6. Which might be helpful. I don't usually use bunkers that much. Ooh, stim packs. We need stim packs. Stim packs are a must. Combat shield, increase marine life by 10. Advanced medical facilities. Medics no longer require the tech lab at all. Double train medics. I need stim packs. And we can't buy anything else except for bunker upgrades. Which I do not really consider top priority. So that's all we'll spend. And let's talk to Swan. Upgrading what we got is all well and good. But when are we getting new hardware? A lot of gaps in our inventory right now. Sometimes we take a job with some kind of new hardware. And I get a schematic for it so we can make more of them. The plans for other stuff... We gotta either beg, borrow, or steal. All viable options. Beg, borrowing, and stealing. They're all good. Alright, let's go to our mission. The star map. What's our general status, Matt? We've picked up a distress call from the planet Agria. There's a colony there under attack by the Zerg. Your convict buddy Tychus lined up a mission retrieving another artifact. It's on a Protoss shrine world called Monolith. Hmm. We have to choose our path. Any ship receiving this transmission. The Zerg are invading Agria. The Dominion abandoned us here. We're just a small farming colony. We've got to evacuate before we're overrun. If you can hear this message, please help us. Ooh, that was a female! Let's see what's here. The Mobius boys think there's another artifact in a world called Monlith. Supposedly, there's Potas guarding it. A group of fanatics call themselves the Taldarine. Now don't get all sentimental thinking these tall to ream are your old Protoss buddies. Cause they ain't. Hmm. Save lady. 
get less money, get Zerg research, or get more money, fight Protoss, and get Protoss research. I forget. I think if you do one, you can do the other one later. So let's just save the lady first, because we're nice. We're nice, horny guys. Yeah, I didn't say horny. Transition. What? Thank you so much for responding to our distress call, Commander. I'm Dr. Ariel Hansen, and I represent the people of the Ivory I Agri represent Colony. all 20 of us. Pleasure to meet you, Doc. You can call me Jim. What's the situation? My... The Zerg have overwhelmed our planetary defenses. The colony is lost. For the past 12 hours, we've been evacuating people to the nearest starport, but the Zerg attacks have become so intense, we can't get any more through. If you can guard the highway, we can start sending the remaining groups every few minutes. Don't worry, Doc. We'll get your folks through to that starport safe and sound. I pray you're right, Commander. The Zerg are more terrible than I ever imagined. Yeah. <laughs> they are pretty badass. Won't lie about that. Alright, we're gonna start the evacuation. Now... Hmm, I don't know what else to say. Basically, we're gonna save this doctor dude. We're gonna save... We're gonna protect a highway, a road. Get on as much colonists out as possible. I probably won't save all of them because this is brutal, and I don't know the best way to finish this. So we're gonna start now. And here's our dropship. Fire, fire with fire. Fire, fire batter. We got some fire batter. I got us some fire bats, cowboy. These suckers have got flamethrowers that'll roast the Zerg, but good. Ready to fry. Oh, yeah. Our allies are being attacked. Ooh, minerals. Mm, let's get cooking. Oh, poor girl. Barbecue time. 